know if I remember a particular person right off, but the year that I was 10, I think, my um, Sunday school teacher, we, I lived in Los Alamos, New Mexico, and it was designed, the town was built by physicists and engineers, so all the churches were on one street. <laughs> yeah. you know, the That's zoning remarkable. was kind of <laughs> primitive. And um, so I had the Sunday school teacher who decided that for our Sunday school class for a year, we were going to go to all the churches on the street. And so about once a month, we would go visit another church's service during our Sunday school hour. And so that was my um, sort of initiation into interfaith participation. And it was a really wonderful way to do it because that, because it was in in this very Mormon context and with, you know, complete sanction of everyone. And so I never had this sense. I can remember when I got to college, there were people who were like, oh, well, you know, go to another church service. Is that okay? Can we? And I never had that sense that there was anything threatening or distressing or um, frightening about going and, and listening and even participating with, with worship in another denomination. I've always been really, really glad for that introduction. Yeah.